Hi guys, and today I will be sharing with you my Do It On A Dime Fall Edition slash Thanksgiving Edition for 2015. I started this last year and I had so much fun and what I did was I tried to find some Dollar Tree items or you know things that were less expensive and try to create a tablescape or I tried to incorporate it just in home decor for my home. So this year is no different. Um, I will be incorporating some of the things that I used last year and also sprucing it up with just some new additions that I have. So I will have the link down below in the description box so you guys can go over and check out the playlist from last year's Do It On A Dime. But I'm super excited guys. I think I found some really great items uh, from the Dollar Tree. And so let me just jump right in and show you guys. Now, what I'm going to be doing is I will be using this cream colored, it has um, gold around the rim of it and I will be setting my table with this and I got the bowl and the plate. I also will be using these charger plates here and again these were at the Dollar Tree and I know you can pick these up at your local Michaels but I found it at the Dollar Tree and so this is a gold color. I'm really really into the gold and then this bouquet that I have here that I will you know have to uh, straighten it up a little bit I had that last year on my table so I will be reusing that this year and I'm gonna try to kind of give it a facelift this year this little sign here picked up at the Dollar Tree I also picked up these glassware here again they have the gold rim around them and I will be using this on my tablescape now I know these colors here do not go with the decor I'm looking more of a gold and cream color um, display but what I'm going to do is I am going to spray paint those yep I am pulling out the spray paint and I will be spray painting these I also found this little burlap flower here and not sure what I'm going to do with this, but I will be using that as well. And then I'll just briefly show you the pumpkins that I got last year. And I love these pumpkins. And so I probably won't do anything with these pumpkins. I'll keep them in their natural state. I really like this one here, and I think it's going to uh, marry really well with the um, table scape that I'm trying to go for. I also got this one and I have picked up two additional ones this year and this is how they look before because I'll show you the altered pumpkin I did last year all from the Dollar Tree and this is the one that I created last year so let me just show you guys here is the pumpkin I created last year. Really, really love how it came out. So as you can see, I pulled out the spray paint last year. I gave it a cream color and added some gold uh, bling and lots of flowers, some skeletal leaves, and I just actually just redefined this pumpkin and I had so much fun. So this year I'm going to give this pumpkin some sisters. And I picked up this ribbon here. And as you can see, it has a gold and cream color there. And last but not least, I have a runner here. Now, I'll probably use this on another area in my um, home, but I did pick this up. And so, guys, stay tuned, and I will show you how all of this come together. Thank you. As promised guys, here is the finished table setting. Very simple guys, very simple. I just took some old decor I had and I added some new items. I added this acorn little um, plate here with a gold apple that I spray painted as well as the pepper that I spray painted with cream and added some gold to the top. Here is the pumpkins that I had last year and the one that I um, altered. I also added that bow or that ribbon down at the bottom of that arrangement there. 
and then there is the pear that I also spray painted and I love these little plates that you can pick up from the Dollar Tree don't look over your Dollar Tree guys when you just want simple decor you can pick it up there and that's a really pretty little leaf you can add nuts and mints and things like that to it to really make it very festive I added a candle here from Bath and Body Works, of course, the sweater weather. I am almost hitting pan on that. I really love that candle. And then this is how the place setting looks. I simply added the charger, some plates, that saucer, and then just put the pumpkin in the center of the bowl. Very, very simple. So I just wanted to show you guys again ways that you can use some Dollar Tree items just to add a little decor to your home and I have a square table so I don't really have a very large table so I have to you know kinda use what I have and so this is my tablescape guys I will have some still photos at the end so you guys can have a better view of how this table setting come out it is a table setting for four alright guys I will also show you a quick tip on how I created a cake um, plate just with Dollar Tree items. So let me show you that. And you have lots of desserts during your Christmas or Thanksgiving dinner. You can create this really simple cake plate by simply getting these plates here from the Dollar Tree. I'll pan in a little bit closer so you can see it. It's just a crystal or a clear plate with some decorative edges and I have not adhered it. I'm sorry about the shakiness of the camera so I can show you guys that this comes off and so it's just a regular candlestick holder and you can add this to the top. You can glue it. I, I would most definitely glue it with some very sturdy glue. Create you a cake plate for your family dinner and so if you need several several cake plates you can do this so again this is just a very cheap way to add some decor to your holiday um, dinners thanks guys so much for watching and if you are not a subscriber please do subscribe so you won't miss any of my uploads I'll talk to you guys later and have a happy Thanksgiving bye